Well, the warmer weather is here. We've got temperatures right now in the low 80s with a ton of sunshine around 81. The current report at Memphis International Airport 81 in Holly Springs. 79 in Tunica, so needless to say, some great spring weather. Hopefully you got outside, uh, but hopefully you held on to your hat because it has been a little breezy today. That southerly wind bringing in all that warm air, but we've had gusts in eastern Arkansas up to 40 miles an hour, and it is windy for just about everybody. Gusts right now in Memphis, 37 miles an hour. So if you're thinking about burning something today, it's not a good idea. Those fires can get out of control very quickly. And it is going to be windy for the next several days as our next weather maker rolls in tonight. Temperatures don't fall much. We're only going to be around 60 degrees more cloud cover rolling in by midnight. I can't rule out a sprinkle tonight, but I think a lot of the rain it's going to hold off until tomorrow. Notice we do stay windy tonight. South southwesterly winds continuing tonight at around 15 miles an hour. All right, your Monday shapes up like this. We're going to wake up in the 60s. Could see some showers in the morning, but I think the better chance for storms is going to be in the afternoon and even into tomorrow night. Now, not everybody's going to see rain. I do want to let you know that you could go all day tomorrow and not see any rain. But if you do see a storm pop up in your neighborhood, it could be strong. We do have a risk for severe weather. This is tomorrow's outlook, a level two out of five risk for Memphis, all of eastern Arkansas and parts of western Tennessee, just about everybody else in a level one out of five. So our main concerns tomorrow with any storm that does pop up is going to be some gusty winds, maybe some small hail and of course heavy rain and lightning. That's something we're going to keep an eye on. Here's Tuesday's outlook uh, about the same, but a little bit different. A level two in place for eastern Arkansas and a level one for Memphis and everybody else. It's not going to be as rainy on Tuesday. There's going to be less storms, but again, if a storm can pop up on Tuesday, it could produce some gusty winds or small hail. Let's take it right through to Wednesday because this is the day we're really going to watch. Notice that risk level increases Wednesday to a level three out of five, which is a medium risk, and this is where we could have some more serious severe weather. Again, this is Wednesday. We're talking damaging wind gusts, maybe some hail and the possibility for tornadoes. So that's Wednesday. Everybody in that level three risk, and that is something we are going to watch very, very closely. Let's time it out hour by hour. Starting off right now, we've got mostly sunny skies. Here comes the cloud cover tonight. Again, I don't expect a whole lot of rain, at least until tomorrow. Here's 7 a.m. tomorrow. Some light showers scattered around. I don't think it's a big deal. Tomorrow afternoon could see a pop up storm or two. But maybe a better chance of storms tomorrow evening, 8 p.m. Monday, heavy storms developing in eastern Arkansas, just north of Memphis. Those are the ones that could produce some hail, and then we'll take it right into Tuesday again, starting off dry. But any storm that does develop by Tuesday afternoon, here they come by Tuesday evening, could also produce some gusty winds and some small hail. Again, it's Wednesday. We're really watching. That's when the cold front swings through and brings us our best chance for severe weather. So spotty storms Monday and Tuesday. Not everybody's going to see them, but the best chance for severe weather and storms is going to come in on Wednesday. Seven day forecast looks like this. Some spotty storms on Monday. High of around 73, 78 Tuesday. Not as wet. Still some spotty showers. Some storms likely Wednesday. That's our risk for severe weather. Our highest risk for severe weather this week. Thursday, Friday looking good. Another slight chance of rain by Easter weekend. Don't think it's a big deal right now, but something to watch over the next few days.